So after six years, in 1992, Fricker thought it was time to organize a second worldwide uh, congress. This time the focus was not just on mail art, but the name of the congress was uh, 1992 Networker Congress. So any kind of creative networking could be part of it. And my friend Pier Mario Ciani designed uh, coordinated graphics for, uh, for the whole year of congresses. As you can see, there was even a stationery with different addresses for, for uh, uh, people, headquarters in different countries of people who cooperating in organizing the congresses. And then, of course, leaflets, uh, rubber stamps, uh, posters, uh, even a special issue of uh, my mail art magazine Arte Postale with the vinyl single in it with Let's Network Together, a hymn to be played before every Congress session began. And a lot, a whole lot of stickers distributed in hundreds of copies so that uh, authors could use them to promote the Congress but also to make uh, performances like this one you see here or uh, this big uh, sticker would, you could write your name of it on it so you could uh, uh, it was joking on what happens in the normal Congresses of people having the name in front here is from Poland Andrzej Dudek Durer and me doing a small congress here in Viareggio. Here you can see in Switzerland uh, Mark Poulsen, Fricker and France and there's even a, a flag designed by Pier Mario with the notorious uh, logo of the four arrows that make up a envelope. Uh, and um, and this this flag was circulated between congresses when it was used in a congress would be mailed to the next one and so on here you see fricker with the pole uh, with the pointing in four direction four different direction but always networker congresses on it a t-shirt with the same image and this is the big uh, chronology catalog that peter kaufman in Switzerland produced at the end of the year with reports from really uh, over a hundred different congresses and a lot of smaller publications, more postcards, uh, uh, booklets with statements from networkers uh, and um, other smaller publications produced in relation to the various congresses or, or posters like this, this big one. So the 1992, the second big year of the centralized congresses was really even more successful than the first one.